information. I just want to keep an information on record. Few weeks ago, uh, Congress leader Mr. Rahul Gandhi he visited London, and he had a secret meeting with Tariq Rahman, the acting chairperson of Bangladesh Nationalist Party, and he gave green signal to this what is happening in Bangladesh now, Taliban takeover of Bangladesh. Now, Hindus are being persecuted. He was trying to oust that government, oust that government, and have his own allied government in Bangladesh, and that's what we are saying now, seeing now. And I can assure you, and I can guarantee you on record, that again I'm saying, Rahul Gandhi met Tariq Rahman in London, and he is a part of the CIA and ISI conspiracy of destabilizing Bangladesh and turning this country into a neo-Taliban state. And that's why Congress is silent on the persecution of Hindus in Bangladesh. Well, in that case, I think Congress party will have to clarify whether this meeting happened. Uh, I can guarantee uh, you. To, to, I can guarantee you. To, to, this to, meeting took place. And I'm saying it based on very credible... No, but you are, what you're saying is a very sensational charge that can, behind uh, the scenes, uh, Rahul Gandhi, you are saying on some kind of an encouragement of the American deep state meets a Jamaat-e-Islami supported BNP leader Tariq Rahman in London. And can and I tell you why? Uh, can I explain to you why? Why he nodded? Because he knew this takes place in Bangladesh. You know, now these Islamists are say, claiming that West Bengal and Seven Sisters must become a part of Bangladesh. They have released a map, new map. So Rahul Gandhi knew that once it happens in Bangladesh, India will be destabilized. Narendra Modi will be in trouble. That's why he has done this. 